Yo, yo! Hello, everybody. This is Angry African. Today, I'm showing you the Cursed Ball Summoner, updated for 1.2.0. The first thing you'll notice about the new Cursed Ball Summoner in Forsaken Masters is that, well, we have no balls. Uh, and that's because of an uh, interesting change to Curse on Hit. Uh, in Forsaken Masters, Curse on Hit applies 100% of the time, which makes, I feel, Arc the superior option for applying the Curse. We don't need to use GMP to apply. And it means we can apply four, yes, four curses on hit. Now, this spec is incredibly powerful, and I've been using it to clear very fast and very effectively uh, thus far in the Beyond League. As you can see, demons just die very quickly, and enemies are no problem when they are quad cursed. Quad curse? Quad curse! How do we do that? Well, that's a good question. And let me show you. Currently, I am running a six-link tabula rasa. And with it, I'm running Arc with five chains, Temporal Chains to slow down and disable enemies, and Feeble to weaken uh, enemies so they don't kill me or my minions, Elemental Weakness for more elemental damage. Let's just handle these demons here. Uh, and finally, Vulnerability to increase the physical damage of my minions with Curse on Hit. With this, and you can see Arc just bounces around, curses everything. Not only were we making uh, enemies really, really weak, but our damage is absolutely insane with the double curse, uh, offensive curse. On top of that, we are running Elemental Equilibrium, so we are reducing Cold and Fire Resist by 50. Add that with Elemental Weakness, and you're reducing Cold Resist by about 90. So this is a massive elemental damage boost to your minions, on top of vulnerability being a massive physical boost. And this is great, because we are running three auras. We are running Purity of Elements to grant us and our minions elemental resistances, Vitality to, to grant us and our minions life regen, and Hatred. Hey, where is the Hatred? Well, we are running Hatred with Generosity to greatly increase the ice damage that our minions deal, both evangelists and zombies. So let me, let me go through and show you the links of this build very quickly. On our Aurum Vorax, with uh, 55 to all resists, we are running Flesh Offering, Convocation, and Arctic Armor. We can't actually run Arctic Armor yet. We're going to need a Cloak of Defiance. So it's going to be a while. On our Gloves, we are running Ray Spectre, with Spell Echo, Minion Damage, and Increased Area of Effect. On our Helm, which will soon be a plus two Minion Helm, we are running Ray Zombie, Multi Strike, Malay Splash, and Minion Life. On our Shield, we are running Hatred, Generosity, and Reduced Mana. And on our Booties, we are running Purity of Elements, Desecrate, Vitality, and Reduced Mana. With this, with this I have been dominating the content thus far in uh, the Beyond League. Demons are no problem, enemies are no problem, and it's been a whole lot of fun. So I'm going to be linking a uh, written guide of this build uh, to, pro to provide a little bit more detail on what you need to do and how you can get here. But thus far and beyond, I've been having a whale of a time. This build seems very, very, very effective in killing and destroying content. If you want to see this build played live in action, I will be streaming it uh, for nearly every day on, uh, in the Beyond League. And it's on Twitch, t uh, Twitch TV, Angry AA you can see a link to my stream in the description below. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this build. It's nice to update it for 1.2.0 and to see it's even stronger uh, than in 1.1.5. Summoners are not dead at all. In fact, they are incredibly powerful, maybe even cookie cutter. So I hope you enjoy. Hope to see more summoners out there. This is Angry African. Cheers.